my channel my name is Bill and today we're gonna be playing some Sims 2 um yep this is a new OP I know I'm saying so many let's plays I'm not even keeping track <laughs> this is bad okay because I'm in the end I'm not gonna have any games to play anyways we're gonna start with the Sims 2 University we're gonna start with creating a team going making them go to university and then you know spreading their wings and creating their own family um, but yeah, um, my name is Bill. welcome to my channel. I'm still a pretty small channel, but if you guys see my videos, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I'm 15 and I like to play <laughs> video games. I don't know, it's my description. Um, the Sims 2 is near and dear to my heart. I mean, The Sims, pretty much all The Sims franchise is pretty much dear and, really dear and near to my heart and I really love playing it. But yeah, let's get started. We're gonna, I don't know if we should go to La Fiesta Tech or Sim State University. I'm gonna read them off to you guys one by one. La Fiesta Tech. It's easy to see why Sims from all over flock to La Fiesta as their college of choice. But don't be deceived by the quiet desert landscape. Though far from the bustle of city life, the desert setting offers plenty of excitement of its own. And it does look pretty small, so I don't know. I'm pretty much like a bigger kind of type sim town person but I actually like small places Academy the Latour Academy the Tour prides itself on its careful balance of old traditions and ideas with spacious campus and world renowned professors in every classroom what more could a sim want and Sim State University which is Sim State University is honored by a group of sims wishing to educate for future generations Though it, it has become a modern social and scholastic hub, the school still maintains high standards of learning. So I'm in between these two, Sim State University or um, La Fiesta Tech. Uh, I'm thinking we should go with Sim State University, see what that's all about. Um, but yeah, hopefully... We'll get this off soon. Or whatever. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Um, but yeah, I really apologize for not really uploading often. Um, you know, I have work. I just came out of school on the 26th of May. I know, I had time to record. But I started work and it's just been really busy. So, you know, keeping up my summer job. And yeah, so I have a few days off. So I was like, why not? Okay, welcome to Sim State University. The school year is about to begin once again. The new students have arrived, moved in, and they're ready to learn. As usual, this year's mix of personalities on campus is sure to create all manner of drama and excitement. Some Sims may l find love, others long time friends. Some may graduate with honors, others might not be so focused. But no matter what happens between them, will this new class uphold the university's good reputation? It sure will. Well, I really want, um, hope so. <laughs> The Uriel or Esha Cham, I pretty much butchered that name, house is the oldest fraternity on campus with a long and prestigious history. Can the brothers keep the historic house united or will their drastically different personalities divide them instead? The Trivar sorority may be the nicest Greek house on campus, but with sisters like Heather and Brittany, will Tiffany be able to convince anyone else to join? Jane, Martin, and Allegra wanted to escape the craziness of campus life and decided to find their own place. Can they still have the college experience or will they just get lonely? Damn. This sucks, guys. Okay, I'm gonna create a new student. I don't know who. Uh, I don't know what I'm thinking they should look like. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see how we create this one because I really hope they look good and I want them to get straight A's I mean I'm the type of person gotta study you know gotta study for those finals I'm probably gonna skip this so yeah I'm just rambling oh hello there what should we do enter household name what is their last name gonna be okay you guys so I'm pretty 
pretty much gonna go with Smith. <laughs> Cause that's all I got, bro. Um, let's get a big girl. Cause, you know, that's the way. I thought I put, oh my gosh, never mind. What's her first name gonna be is the question. I'm gonna go with Scarlet. I love Scarlet. I love the name Scarlet. Scarlet Smith. Yay! I know. Sounds pretty like a really bad name, but you know, what else could I do? This is Scarlet. I don't know. She doesn't look <laughs> happy, but yeah, we're gonna go with Scarlet. Sorry, you're like the only one in the household. Way to go. You went to college. That's a great time in your life. Ooh, I just I'm just like looking at my phone right now. And it's, there's some names right here that I love. Quinn and Kiera. Oh, those names. Gorgeous. Anyways. Let's see. We're gonna move her in. Is the thing. Uh, you can't go on a sorority? What? Do I have to go here? No. You guys, I'm probably gonna have to go to the other one then. Let's see, do they have dorms? You know what? We're going to Sims State. You know, <laughs> I made my decision finally. We're going to Sims State and we're gonna go in this 14 room dormitory. Because why not? Guys, it's official. We're going to Sim State University. We're gonna go to the lot tag and then all the whatever. I'm pretty much done. Hopefully, it is take, doesn't take forever. Yay! So, Scarlett Smith, the boss, SNS. 
I'm rambling here, you guys. I don't even know what to say right now. Oh, yeah. Anyways, if you guys are still in school, when do you guys get out? That's a question I need to know. I already got out, like you said. May 26th was our last day. Um, going into 10th grade. Be a sophomore. Yo, that's weird. This okay. This doesn't look too bad. Uh, let's see. Hold the phone. Um, so we already started. Whoa. It's been taking forever. Um, she needs to go pee already. What the heck? Yo, calm your bladder. Wait, she needs to clean my room first, though. First of all. I don't even know which room she should get. <laughs> they have closets here. Right? Uh... She can get the room in the corner. Nobody better take that room. Because I think she's going to be there. I think she's going to take that room. Because she's, she's kind of like a loner. <laughs> She'd be like, let's go to this room. Go. Run up there, girl. Before people come. Go. Thank you. Now we can go use. Look, there's like black stuff under her when she walks. I don't know about that, you guys. So I, I don't know what that is. I'm gonna need to fix that, so I'm sorry about that. Wait, it's one day left of summer, so it's gonna be fall? Oh, yeah. It's really the time when we go into school. We usually start school here in September, where I live. Like, beginning of September, sometimes at the end of August. But I don't really mind, so. Anyway, uh, what does she have to do? She needs to, first of all, she has to meet friends. Her GPA has to be a 4.0, because, you know. We need that. The world survey of everything that ever happened. 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. is her school. Oh, yeah. This may just increase. Do we choose the... Damn. Freshman, sophomore, junior, senior. Okay, we got 72 hours until final exam, really? How do we declare a major, you guys? I don't even know. Do we like ah oh, whatever. Uh they're already cooking for us. Let's go eat that. Yay. We're officially plating guys. Officially officially. Um the starting the life of Scarlet. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna search something up real quick so you guys enjoy her. Um I'm gonna search up how to declare a major in the sims 2 because i don't even know i haven't played this in a while let's see Woo. see this is a long time this is gonna bother me mm. i'll take your time scarlet oh david david sims <laughs> original last time you guys I think you can declare your major in the computer. Hold up. College. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that was easy. I didn't even need to. I didn't even have to do anything. Let's see. What is she gonna. I don't know what she should major in. Like, for real. Like, I don't know. Let's see what she's gonna pick. What options are there? Because I don't even know. I'm more of like a like I love The Sims 2. I love playing Sims 3 and Sims 4 as well. I haven't played Sims 1 in a while. What major will Scarlett Smith choose to study? There's psychology, history, physics, literature, political science, mathematics, economics, biology, philosophy, art, and drama. Yo. What is this? Let's see, what is this? Let's go one by one because, you know, some of you probably don't even know this. Um, psychology, the study of the mind, 
Everyone is aware of the complexity of a sim's brain, but a few understand its workings. A sim is indeed a wild mix of as aspirations, personalities, and base instincts, and perhaps only one who studies psychology could understand the be me method behind this madness. Ideal careers is law, education, intelligence, business, law enforcement, or paranormal. Oh, paranormal sounds cool. Full skills, skills, cleaning, charisma, creativity, logic. Pretty much four of the main skills. History, the study of the past from the paintings of the earliest cave sim to last week's change of menu at our local schools. Those who study history often go into military service or politics due to the desire to visit the mistakes of the past to make a better future for some kind. Ideal careers are law, artists, military, and politics. Well, those are a few. Um, excuse my... Oh, excuse my... I'm sorry if you hear people in the background. It's just that, you know... I have siblings. Focus skill, charisma, mechanical, creativity... Creativity and logic. Nah, that's not for me. Physics. The study of the many forms of energy. Those who study physics learn the inter intricacies of the world around us, allowing them to harness nature to do amazing things. In other words, physicists give society cool things like lasers and catapults. Which is amazing. Ideal careers are gamer, medicine paranormal and science focus skills cleaning mechanical creativity and logic oh that's pretty much yo i think that's for her i'm gonna do that <laughs> i'm already designing literature the study of the written word reading and writing may seem like a basic skill but language is powerful and those who study literature can harness this power to commit it educate or dominate other sims music adventurer entertainment criminal show business and slacker Charisma, mechanical, creativity, and body. Those are a lot of careers. Political science major. Political science. Those, the study of people in power. Those who study political science gain a knowledge of the workings of people and groups and learn the subtle skill of manipulation and influence. This command can, this command over other sim can, sims can lead to a number of careers, including, of, of course, politics. Uh, ideal careers, law, intelligence, military, politics, and show business. Focus skills, clean charisma, creativity, and body. You guys, I'm trying to go south again because I think physics is for me. Mathematics, the study of numbers and basic forms. Math is not something that comes naturally to every scene, but those that learn to understand it can see the patterns and science all around them and have uncanny insight into the mechanical and logical. Gamer, Arctic. Ar architecture, criminal, natural science, and science, cleaning, mechanical creativity, and logic. Economics, the study of services and com commodities. If it has to do with simoleons, these folks know how to do it. If it isn't, if it isn't an easy job, but a talented economist, economic economist who can figure out the markets, and make makes quite the business person. Music, intelligence, business politics and show business charism, charisma mechanical creativity and logic biology the study of life trees gazelles sims smooth endoplasmic reticulum what makes them work if it cells a biologist can set a biologist can study it and find out unfortunately they don't know a darn thing about robots um education uh, ocean oceanography well that's the first law enforcement medicine and natural science cleaning mechanical body and logic philosophy the study of the fundamental problems of existence and some understanding it is a metaphorical mumbo jumbo or the only path to enlightenment regarding the problems of some kind hard to say one fact is undisputable though philosophy textbooks have some of the longest words ever um, journalism, culinary, paranormal, and slacker. Cooking, charisma, creativity, and logic. Art, the study of visual forms. What better pursuit than to devote one's life to the pursuit of the beautiful or thought-provoking? While the disciplines are di diverse indeed, all artists are brought together with one goal, creation. Journalism, architecture, artist, culinary, and slacker. Cooking, charisma, mechanical, and creativity. And the very last one. Drama, the study of performance. Sims are born to perform, be it dancing, joking, or busting a move. However, it is only those sims who, 
delve into drama that managed to transcend merrymaking and create art. Ideal careers. Entertainment, dance, oh gosh, athletic, politics, and show business. Charisma, creativity, buddy, and logic. And like I said, I think from her, the best would probably be... I think it's going to be physics. So that's what we're going to do. Continue in physics 1, measuring falling stuff, 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. What, two hours? That's not that bad. So let's start with a cooking right now, actually. Like, why not? Uh, let's see. Serve some lunch meat sandwiches. Um, and she needs to work on charisma. How do we work on charisma? Oh, yeah, that and fixing stuff or books <laughs> that's easy yo that me reading that thing was took like what probably 15 minutes i'm sorry guys um read book nah. study mechanical i'll do that and then we'll probably practice our speech and then we'll meet some people why not? Because lots of people are moving in, I guess. Oh, she's pretty. Yo, you know it's a sim when you see the black stuff under it. Like, I don't even know what's up. Um, oh, those look actually pretty good. Where did it go? Can I eat, really? Yo. I need to talk to people, you know, they're social. Now we'll work with those later. What is she gonna do here? Work out? Yo, who has time to work out? Go meet some people. Oh, Ryan. Talk to Ryan. Or greet Ryan. How do you greet him? Let's see. Whatever. Chat with him. Chat with Nicholas. Talk to Gina. Gina, Gina. Yo. Ryan looks so weird, dude. Mm. Looks like a... <laughs> and this. Ooh, she gained something. Yay, she gained an aspiration. Uh, she wants to fall in love. That is weird. She wants to fall in love, too. That's the first. Oh, right away. Oh, well, then I guess she does have the the family aspirations, so I wouldn't blame her. Go meet other people. What are you doing? Okay, stop talking to him. Go meet other people, first of all. I mean, it's not like they're going anywhere. Oh. Hello? Hayim! Did you just- oh my gosh. Really? <laughs> you guys better- oh. This little- mm, I said she was pretty, but I swear, if she freaking- Tasha, get the- please. Metal, you good. You good. We good. I'm gonna talk to you, cause you-, you. I can see you're gonna be a great friend. Wow, we both got brown hair. I mean, that doesn't matter, but we both got brown hair. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Chat with her again. Does she have to do anything? I think. Wait, does she have to do anything? Let's see. Write your term paper. You should go through that, probably. <laughs> go meet the lunch man. The lunch dude. Oh, who's that? Oh, it's David Sims. The one I called his last name unoriginal. And it kind of is, though. Yeah, I don't blame him. Newtonian physics. Oh, I hate. Oh, my gosh. I had physical science. Yo, I do not like that. I'm sorry I made you get that, but I mean. It sounded interesting, so you're gonna go with it. Scar sorry, Scarlet. I'm gonna take a picture of her like this. Be like, start from the bottom, now we're here. So we're gonna do that. 
Um, and then I'm probably gonna end the part there because I mean you're just barely starting what oh yeah I was like what happened to the beds but once they claim they're claimed you can't see the room no do not disturb their room let's see have they cleaned the other ones <laughs> and then there's me I cleaned the one in the corner such a loner you guys I should probably go meet some people I really like um, how I choose this I chose this place because first of all you have lots of friends nearby I don't care if it's a dorm she has lots of friends nearby even though she pretty much has a room in the corner like a loner um, did you finish your term paper? she's 85% done damn girl you were going fast in that um, oh yeah there's Meadow Marielle well Marielle looks pretty as well I should talk to her. Oh, oops, sorry. Didn't see you wanted to. Uh, you know what? I'm still in action. I'm not even looking at her needs, and I'm over here like, do this and do that, and I forget. <laughs> How do you do it? Oh, yeah, you take a shower over here. Sucks to do that. And she wants to go to sleep already. It's 6 p.m., girl. What are you doing? understand but girl you need to have some fun Let's TV after I know what we're doing yo I'm actually pretty scared to go to college like you're gonna be on your own like not saying I don't want to be on my own but it's gonna be scary my brother's heading off to college and that's weird I mean he's gonna still be living with us because the college she's going to is really close by and I don't know it's gonna be weird I'm barely talking about way to the I'm a sophomore thinking about college there's beautiful and dry presently but we might see some light snow later in the day really? Your fun is barely going up. You have to go to sleep. It's eight. Sorry, but I can't help you today. I'm out at the pool. Sleep in your pajamas. <laughs> Whatever. Your fun can wait. Whatever. She can wake up later. It's gonna be like my other sims that wake up freaking. I'm sorry if it's like, but wake up freaking like three in the morning. Like, that's not cool, okay? And if you wake up, you gotta work on your time paper. I don't care. And you gotta keep going. Keep going until 7. I mean, 9. Or 8, because I'm gonna get your ass up. Gotta get you go down to eat breakfast. Okay. Ready, 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 ready at 5 in the morning. 5 in the morning. No, I'm changing my mind. Wake up at six. Oh, she did wake up at six. What the heck? Um, he served us breakfast already. Get some of these pancakes. And then once you're done with that, use the rest. Ooh, now, who is this? That's Ryan. Yo, I think Ryan is the one. Who is this? Paul. Paul and Calvin. Nick Kalo, Kalo. I don't even know. You guys, I'm sorry if I butchered the name. Let's see. He's talk She's talked to. She's gonna meet other people though. She can talk to David. I don't know because David sounds pretty good. Cool. Sounds like a pretty cool guy. And then she can go dance. Work her ass off. Go. Wait. By the time she gets there, I'm gonna get her. Eight. It's gonna be eight. Scarlet has class in one hour. Yes, thank you for the notice. Uh, let's see. Her, her fun is going down. I don't know what makes you want to have fun. 
Let's see. Watching the TV or playing. Okay, I know. I get that. Okay, she's gonna go to college. To a first class. Woo! Yay! Let's see how she does. Hopefully it's pretty good because, you know. Girl, you need to get that GPA to a 4.0. Oh crap, crap, crap. It's going too fast. Scarlet met Professor Spencer Downey in class today. Downey Robert Jr. Robert Downey Jr. I did that wrong. I'm sorry. Oh. Scarlet met Professor Professor Tasha Timble Trimble in class today. Yeah, you're meeting. Oh, what are you doing, nigga? I, I'm sorry. It's, it's not meant to be an offensive way. Sorry. It's not meant to be offensive. I'm not racist or anything. So I'm sorry I said that. I apologize. Uh, what should you guys do? Go watch a movie. What are you doing? Your fun is up. I mean, your fun is down. Really, you guys, I did not mean to offend anyone. Just so you know. So sorry about that. Anyways, I think we might end this part here. Um. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna end this part here. Uh. You know, Scarlet starting her first day off. She has 45 hours to, so it's technically two days. She got, she has to, um, now we'll just leave it like that. And then I'm sorry to say there's heavy rains out there currently with continued heavy snow. Yeah, so I think we're just gonna end this here. Um, you know, Scarlett's first day of college and she's been meeting great people. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I know her mood is like down because you know, I gotta get her, gotta get her some fun. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed. And I really hope, really, really hope I was recording this time because then I would have to start all over. And that's not, I don't have time for that. So I'm at 30 right now. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye. Adios. There is a system. Oh!